Good morning children. I hope you all are keeping yourself safe by being at home and adopting hygienic practices. Enjoy studying from home and keep on doing your home assignments of all the subjects. Keep healthy, respect and obey elders. Now about your studies. We have already completed the chapter. Explanation part is over. Next definition part is also over. Here the keywords what we have having we have done those keywords. Now about this is the summary of the chapter. Go through it once. Next is the exercises that we have to discuss. First question, you must be familiar with the following nursery rhymes. Baba Baba Black Sheep, have you any wool? Mary had a little lamb whose fleece was white as snow. Answer the following, which parts of the black sheep have wool? It's the hairy fiber. What is meant by white fleece of the lamb? White furry skin. This is the answer. The silk worm is a caterpillar, a larva. Choose the correct option. It's third, both A and B. Which of the following does not yield wool? It's woolly dog. Obviously, we get wool from yak, camel, goat. It's not woolly dog. What is meant by the following terms? These three words are given in the keywords and we have written the definitions. Already done. Given below, fifth question is given below is the sequence of steps in the processing of wool. Which are the missing steps? Shearing is the first, second is scoring, third is sorting, fourth is picking burrs, fifth is dyeing, sixth is making of yarn. Sixth question, make sketches of the two stages in the life history of the silk moth which are directly related to the production of silk. This is your homework children to draw the life cycle of silk worm that I will be giving in the attachment. Please go through it and draw the life cycle of silk worm. Seventh question, out of the following, which are the two terms related to silk production? Answer is sericulture and moriculture. The scientific name of mulberry is morus alba and rearing of mulberry leaves is moriculture. So these two terms are related to silk production. Match the words of column 1 with those given in the column 2. Match the column question number 8. Scoring is cleaning of sheared skin. Second, mulberry leaves. It's food of silk worm, yak, wool yielding animal, cocoon, ill silk fibers. So here we go for the ninth question. Given below is a crossword puzzle based on this lesson. Use hints to fill in the blank spaces with letters that complete the words. Thorough washing score 1D. It's 1D score. 2D animal fiber silk. 3D Long thread like structure, it's fiber. Now across, keeps warm, wool, it's wool. 2A, its leaves are eaten by silk worm, mulberry. 3A, hatches from egg of moth, it's caterpillar, it's caterpillar. Here we end the exercise, definitions are done, exercise is over. Next class will be going for the extra question answers which I will be going giving it to you.